Welcome back, folks. All right, it's Thursday, which means it's Friday Eve, weekend Eve. It's almost here, but it's not just any weekend. There's all kinds of stuff going on. That's right. There's a lot happening on and off the ice with the Jacksonville Iceman. And joining us today is the president of the Jacksonville Iceman, Bob O'Roblo. Bob, it's always a fun time when there's a home game, right? You guys just had oh, yeah. one and we killed it. We had one last night. We beat the first place Florida Everblades. Yeah. That gets us into second place. And, nice. uh, you know, with the season coming down the stretch here, we're well into a playoff spot and, and we want to bring the ECHL playoffs right here to Jacksonville. Nice. And, and what game? So we got a game coming up when? And uh, we got the jersey here have, and you always do themes. And yeah, we have two games coming. Saturday is our Teacher Appreciation Day. Very cool. Uh, at 7 o'clock, we're playing Norfolk. And last time we played Norfolk, we beat them 8-5. Yeah. Lots of goals, lots of fights. It was, it was a, quite a game. Um, but all teachers get in uh, free when they buy a ticket. Um, nice. You know, so, so they just have to go to jacksiceman.com slash teachers. And then we'll do some special events throughout the game. Uh, we have the mayor dropping the puck. Uh, oh, so nice. it'll be really a nice, a nice way for us to all appreciate teachers and, and, and watch some exciting hockey. Awesome. But on Sunday afternoon, we have our first Sunday afternoon, which is our Publix Family Fun Day. Okay. And uh, our players will be wearing the jersey you saw in the break. Um, and, uh, right here on the table. And, yeah. <coughs> and uh, we, we have a, a family discount for that game at uh, Jack's, jacksiceman.com slash Publix. Yeah. Both games, teachers and kids, uh, will be invited on the ice after the game and take some slap shots. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, you know, when, when we talk about uh, Iceman hockey, we talk about family experience, and uh, we will have that at both games this weekend. That's Good awesome. Stuff. Yeah. Good stuff. Um, all right, so where do we stand? The important thing, you said we're in second place. Yes. How many games left? What's the, the playoff scenarios right now? We have 19 games left. We're six points in a playoff spot. Each win is two points. Um, so we still have a lot of games to win, uh, but, you know, I'd much rather be up and looking to get in as yeah. opposed to trying to get in. Um, Norfolk's a big game. Norfolk's one of the teams in fifth place uh, and they're they're trying to take a playoff spot yeah. away from you know second, third, and fourth place. So that includes us. So you gotta be in the top four to make playoffs. You gotta be right? in the top four in our division to make the playoffs. Yeah. So we're doing yeah. well right now. We're doing very well. I love doing it. very well. Won two straight games and uh, playing very well right now. And we've played them before. I remember you stopped by earlier. We played them a little mm -hmm. earlier before. Um, how do you think What's what's comparison then now? What do you think we'll we'll bring to the ice that maybe we didn't we didn't bring the last time? We're we're healthier. Yeah. You know, um, we have we have uh, most of our players back. Uh, we don't have a lot of guys up in Manitoba, our, our AHL affiliate now. So so we've got a pretty strong team right now. Um, you know, and and uh, and that's a difference between uh, this week and two weeks ago. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, but yeah. Um, you know, we have Chris Newberry back on the ice, and Chris is a, is a vet of 90 NHL games. He's uh, played in over 900 ECHL games and AHL games. Um, he was out for a while with a rib injury, but uh, he's back, and he made his presence known on the ice last night. Um, and he makes, our, he makes some of our other guys even better. You know, he brings the experience we need. And, the, and I, I have to give a shout-out to our coach, Jason Christie, the winningest coach yeah. in ECHL yes. history. 600 Won his 600 game last night. That's um, awesome. And, and it could not have been in a, in a more exciting fashion. I told him I thought you were going to have a heart attack on the bench. <laughs> um, we, we, we got a 3-2 win, and in the last two minutes, they were really pressing hard to score that tying goal, and we, we stopped it. So. Well, there you go. Congrats, we're we're going to do that again this weekend. Oh, yeah. yeah, oh, yeah. We're well, bringing it in. I don't want to make them this close, though. I want to I blow them out. Yeah, so that's that. <laughs> There you go. All right, guys, Appreciate head on it. over to our website, firstcoastliving.net. Make sure you get all these details. Check out the game.